Hello everyone and welcome to yet another battery test video, this time iOS 11.4. First, I will be running Geekbench battery test on iOS 11.3.1. As you can see, all devices have their brightness levels set to the same. And let's just check uh, the battery health on the devices. And there's no battery health of the 5S. So let's uh, see what the levels are at so you can compare it to your own device. And also let's just verify that auto brightness has been disabled on all the devices. As you can see, it is set to off on all devices. So now it's time to start the Geekbench and run the battery test on all these devices. They are all charged to full 100% and they're ready to go. So let's get it started. So devices are ready, so let's cut the power now. So draining these devices uh, from 100% to zero takes about three hours, a little bit more, but I have uh, sped up the video, so this should take uh, around three minutes uh, in the video.
So here we have the final results from Geekbench 4 uh, battery test on iOS 11.3.1. You can pause it if you want to look at these scores uh, more closely, but after we have run the, the test again on iOS 11.4, we will come back to the scores again. So we're back again. Now all devices are upgraded to 11.4 and uh, they have been sitting for almost four hours charging and uh, we're about ready to go again so let's just check the same settings as we did before So all settings are the same as they were when we ran the test on iOS 11.3.1. So let's get uh, ready, launch Geekbench 4 and get the test started on 11.4. So we're ready to start, so let's cut the power now. Thank you. 
So here you have the final runtime scores from uh, iOS 11.4. And let's see what uh, the Geekbench score 4 is on all these four, five, sorry, five devices. So here we have the scores side by side. And as you can see, iOS 11.4 is a massive improvement in battery life versus that of iOS 11.3.1. So in this test on the iPhone 6, 6s, 7 and 8, you get a massive 30 more minutes approximately uh, versus that of iOS 11.3.1. Uh, for the 5s, you only get 4 minutes, but hey, that's another 4 minutes of battery life. So thank you everyone for watching this video and hopefully you have subscribed to the channel. If not, remember the last survey I did showed that all subscribers had more battery life and more speed on their iPhones than non-subscribers. And that is a fact.